Okay, uh, people, you're probably wondering what on earth is going on here. Uh, here we have this marvelly mechanised organic farmer and he's taken to um, hoeing out beans out of a field. So why am I doing this? Um, I don't know if you can see here but there's little stakes in the ground around in this area and this is a trial plot and it's uh, sown by a company called the Organic Seed Producers and uh, they are trialling all different kinds of uh, cereals on one of our fields. Now unfortunately um, they drilled it and a whole load of beans have come up in the trial and I really need to hoe the, the beans out before the, uh, the different cereals come up. Uh, so that's what I'm doing and uh, because they're sewed on narrow rows uh, our hoe can't get in between them so I'm having to hand hoe them. But the rest of the field we can do with our hoe because that's what we've sewn and that's drilled on um, wide rows so our hoe can get in between the plants which I'll show you hopefully either later this autumn or uh, sometime in the spring. Um, but um, I'm very happy to have this trial on the farm uh, because what it does is it shows me what uh, various varieties of wheat and, and uh, triticale and oats will do on this farm and it's all analysed by the company that uh, sows this trial and uh, I get a access to that information so next year I can then use that information to decide what I want to grow uh, without having the expense of having the trial. Of course I give them the land to do it on uh, but still having a trial of your own is a very very expensive job. Um, but uh, I feel my responsibility is to try and make sure that the trial plot is clean and so therefore I'm hand hoeing out uh, these beans. Um, and actually it's funny to think that when I first came on this farm, uh, which is in 1985, we used to hand hoe in between the rows of our sugar beet. Um, uh, then since those days obviously chemicals do all that job, but even in my lifetime I remember hand hoeing. Um, but actually doing a little bit of hand hoeing on this sort of acre plot uh, gives you time to be outside and uh, it takes a while so it's time to sort of contemplate uh, what's been going on and uh, what needs to be done next. So in fact I quite enjoy it. Uh, but anyway there's a proper bit of organic farming for you.